Nimble Serum Tutorial for Beginners Step by Step. Hello guys, Celia here and in this video I'm going to show you how can we easily use Nimble Serum software to grow our business. So here we are on Nimble.com, they provide us the opportunity to work with their Serum, we can even try it for free. So the steps to create the account are quite simple, all we need to do is just to paste our email right up here and in a few seconds we'll come to dashboard where we need to fill like information about name and last name and also like password. Also from this page here we can find some information in the top of the screen and discover the pricing plans but let's try to discover them a little bit later. So we'll come to this page here, basically this is our dashboard, this is our home page. From this page here we can easily interact and start with our, uh, you know, CRM. So the interface is not that easy to understand but let's have a quick tour. So in the left side there is like a small menu with onboarding where we can find all the leads or the deals all these stages we are on uh, we also have like today area where we can find like different uh, tasks upcoming deals signals like events basically all the information is right up here so on this page we can easily find a lot of uh, helpful stuff we can manage our tasks as you can see we can manage signals upcoming deals and so on so basically the steps are quite simple on the uh, contacts folder we can find all the contacts we have we can also find some information like lead type lead status owner privacy if you'll scroll down we can also find like email last contact contact by me and so on. So all the information is right up here. Uh, we can easily add person by simply click on this button here. So all we need to do is just to fill all the information. Do what do we have? Like basically first name, last name, maybe some information about company. We can upload the photo, add email, phone and so on. So basically it's pretty uh, helpful. Also, we can import contacts if you had like experience with another CRM. So we can just simply click on it right up here and then we can connect like different integrations or upload them from the uh, CSV file. Basically, it's pretty cool. On the workflows, we can find all the workflows right up here. As you can see, it looks like this. So we can easily change the view of our board from board to list, for example. So here we can find like new list attempting content like contacted and so on we can easily move one content from the one board to the another as you can see these steps are quite simple and it's pretty easy to understand how to deal with our contact moreover if we'll click on like this um, sticky note right up here we can find all the information about our like customers so here we can find some information uh, also if you scroll down we can find like what deal stages are on active deals interactions and so on so all the information described right up here and it's pretty easy to understand as for me it's easier to deal with a list for this like for nimble but um, you can also like switch to board and so on also we can sort our leads by these uh, categories by a like on the alphabet order and so on find the assignment to tags and stock on the signals we can find all the signals we have but we need to connect like twitters to see uh, some signals on the messages area we can set up our messaging account to interact with our team to interact with others and so on also we have like group messages activities right up here as you can see all of them are described here where we can find some tasks and so on deals uh, where we can manage our deals as you can see we have like also the same thing we can change it to the list like qualification decision makers value proposition boards and so on so also we can drag and drop from one category to the another one and these tabs are quite simple as you can see also we can click find all the necessary information like all what do we need in order to add like new deal we can just simply click on a new deal in the top of the screen and then just add something which is like important type deal name probability accepted close date 
uh, pipelines, stage, and so on. Also, we can add like related contacts, tags, deal fields, and so on. So from this page here, we can easily interact with our deals. On the reports area, we can find um, all the information, all the stats of our CRM, like deal conversion, revenue forecast, deals for loss by reason, like deals won over time, and so on. So these tabs basically, you know, all the, the navigation is just the same as in another CRMs. But as for me, it's a little bit harder to interact with Needle. Um, I saw some CRM systems which are better, like HubSpot or maybe Pipedrive. So basically, it it's on you. You can easily try it and then just uh, discover is it necessary as for you maybe to switch or to find some other stuff. Also, you can find some tutorials on about other CRMs on my channel. But in this case, in every single folder, the navigation is pretty simple. So on the top of the screen, we have the option to interact with our data. For example, on context, we can add person, add company or import context. And also we can interact with like uh, our data right up here. Also in the left, in the additional menu, we can find all contexts. We can find people, companies, smart, important, recently viewed. So basically it's like filter area we can easily switch between like recently added for example recently viewed and so on so these tabs as for me are quite simple and easy to understand on the workflows the navigation is the same data here the options right up here signals messages group messages and so on if you'll try to discover the paid plans we can find that we have like only nimble business plan which is like for monthly paying 29.90 and for nimble like for the annually paying like 24.90 so we can discover like all the features like as uh, relational management uh, with some features here content records like 25,000 basically I think it's pretty cool we can also upgrade our plan as you can see like upgrades available ten dollars per month for an additional ten thousand contacts so basically uh, they have a lot of features and it's pretty cool that they have like only one plan so we can buy it for a thirty dollars and then just use like a full all the features of Nimble CRM. So basically this is a way of how can we use Nimble CRM as a beginner. It's a quick guide. Hope guys this video made your life a little bit easier. And you can also try to find more additional uh, tutorials on my channel if it's necessary about other CRMs or maybe about Nimble. But yeah, that's all for this video. I wish you a very good day. Subscribe to my channel and goodbye.